Yeah, quite interesting. Look at one thing about here. Hardly see any dogs. Oh, better than say. Sometimes this kind of things once you say dogs will appear. Okay, it's better keep quiet. Okay. Okay, let's go. Oh shit, that's when I was gonna say no dog and there's a dog in front lying down there. <laughs> See? Cannot say. Hi, good morning. I'm back at Bangka Chow, the Green Lung. And today I'll be exploring the place on foot. So come, let's go. Back at the bird watching tower. Okay, so the other time I came, not much. I didn't see any birds. So this time, just gonna use it as a training. Some little stair climb elevation. Okay, I'm the top. Yeah, a couple of paths with the end like this. So this is probably the second one. So for the first one I thought I took the wrong path but didn't really think much of it until I reached here. So okay, just have to head back out again. It's a pretty sh long shaded path. It's pretty nice, peaceful, no traffic. And oh, the air is fresh. And that's why they call it the green lungs. So the path actually leads to a trail like this. But I'm not wearing trail shoes. So let's see if I can. Go one round. Okay, and, uh, okay. There's, there's also another path that goes over there. It's not sure, too sure what it is, but I try not to venture too deep. And I think to watch out is spider web. That is something that I always do by placing something like. You know this camera in front of me so at least if there's a spider web you know the camera will <laughs> detect it first okay so it looks like another dead end 
Okay, we play little pond. I don't know how you call that. Okay, still water. All right, and obviously, water like this, there's gonna be plenty of mosquito. So I better head out. Okay, there are a couple of like trail like this. Okay, that leads to the forest, but I didn't really quite want to venture in in fear of been stung by some, you know, poisonous insects or even worse, snake. So, if I'm alone, I think I better not do it. Okay, and yeah, in this forested area, I'm not too sure whether, you know, the mobile signal is good or not. So yeah, this is one of the safety measure that I take. Okay, I've seen this the other time. Okay. And also not too sure what is this and that is actually a spirit house for what I was told. Okay, and uh, so below the trees there are some dresses and there's a many queen. So I'm not too sure what is this for. But oh, I'm alone here so Gotta get out and uh, okay. I was riding here the other time, so it actually leads, it's actually a loop that loops out to where the, um, the bird watching tower near there. Okay, so yeah, it's a pretty nice cooling. Trail yet. Okay, so we have left is no way out, so yeah. You know, when you live in Bangkok, seeing this kind of trail is, is heaven. You know, because you don't, or probably hardly. Or never, I'm not sure. You know, I get to run in trails like this. Because there's always street, road, traffic. Oh yeah, this is good. Recreation. This is the recreation area. I don't know. This bridge leads me to this. Say little stream ponds. It's quite interesting. And I'm not too sure this one leads to where. But there's a path. Let's see. But not too sure where it leads to but I think I better head out I'm scared of snake <sighs> okay probably can explore this place the next time It's a very nice river over here. You can see people actually feeding fishes. Okay, so this is actually a, a like a roundabout. So you can just run around this river along and then yeah, head to a video hub. Hello. Okay, so 
let's head out to the main road and explore a little bit more on this island. Okay, it's actually an island. Okay, this is seated on the bank of the you know, Chapara River with only one road okay, coming in. Okay, it's just like our oh, Sentosa, right? There's a causeway. So, you can actually literally call this an island. Okay, out to the main road. Okay, in this, in this island, you can hardly find any 7 Eleven, alright, but there are plenty of all this convenience store behind. And if you're hungry, there's also food stalls like this. Look. Okay, so don't worry. You are here, hungry, thirsty, service, such stalls available. Okay, so the other time when I came in, there's plenty of this kind of path okay, that leads to the household. Alright, and it's actually this path is actually on Google Map, so it's actually part of the path that you can walk, ride your bike, but not car. Right? It's too narrow for car. <laughs> So this path leads to the house, the houses. Yep, so these are where the people stay. Okay, the yeah, house is actually above the little pond or river. And with this path. See. Okay. I say yep, you can actually bike. It is legal, I guess. I don't know how they go well. It's quite interesting they actually built a door here. Okay, just to prevent people from probably walking in. I'm not too sure. But seriously, if you want to go across, you can actually, you know, go over there and still get in. Right. <laughs> always very tough okay when you have a decision like this to make either to turn here or to turn there okay so you see I do not know where I am all right basically I'll just be anyhow running so left or right all right let's start from here okay let's have to make a decision left okay because nothing is right. <laughs> okay, this is also a, a restaurant of food. Oh yeah, it's closed. Okay. Yeah, quite interestingly, one thing about here. Do you see any dogs? Oh, better don't say. Sometimes those kind of things once you say dogs will appear. Okay, it's better keep quiet. Okay. See says bicycle path. Okay, has a signboard. Okay, best, best urban oasis. Welcome to the eco tourism by bicycle. Okay, you can ride the bicycle in the community. To beware of a lifestyle. Okay, so actually a bicycling track. This is the household. So if you see a gate like this, okay, don't intrude in. Okay. Okay, let's go. Oh shit, that's when I was to say no dog. 
and there's a dog in front lying down there. <laughs> See? Cannot say. Hey. I might go here. That's nobody. It's like there's no dog. Okay, so this is the houses people are living in. Okay, quite interesting. I've ran and chanced upon another jetty. Hey, this is Chopper River. Nice. Okay, so this is another part where I think people will actually cross to you know the main city from here. Okay, so I think it's not very common. I guess and yeah most of them will actually be crossing over the other side but yeah so nice Aye. so I'm back at this junction again so earlier, I turned to the left and I saw the jetty and since there's nothing left, I'm going to head to the right. <laughs> oh, shit. I see a dog. A dog in front. So, what to do when you see a dog? Okay. So, don't run. Just be calm and probably talk to them. Hello. I think he's more afraid of me than me afraid of him. Thanks. Oh, my heart rate went up. Okay. Safe. He also probably be thinking the same. He's safe from me. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Hey, I'm not too sure what this signboard means. I keep seeing this signboard. Not too sure. I think it's, it looks like a jetty. See? Again, I have to make a decision. Is it here or here? Since there's a signboard that says this, let's go and check it out. Probably might be another jetty. Finally, after like oh, five point five and a half km, I'm out of the road. Okay, so where I am now, maybe I 
there's no bicycle track over here so which means that you know this is not part of the cycling route although there might be people cycling over here you know but there's a actually a cycling route on the map okay for the cyclists to follow so they can actually explore you know some of the points so let's continue running I feel like I'm in the marathon race, the very first runner, you know, with the supporting vehicle behind me. <laughs> so as you can see, there are a lot more food stalls okay, at the side of the road, also as behind me, and the road is actually wider here. And this road is actually called Pechahung, okay, which is the main road that leads out to the city. Okay, this is the only road okay, that comes into Mangkachau and out to where the city area is. Okay, okay. wider road, but it's actually pretty long to head out. Back to the temple again. Right, not Ganesha. Hindu temple. Okay. Yes, I'm. Let me see how long have I ran. Ah, oh, 20 km. I'm covered. Okay. So. Yep, there's uh, really a lot more to explore right during this area and right inside the path and I actually was stuck in that very path for probably about what, 3 km, 4 or 5, I can't really remember and that is actually just a very small part of that area when I was actually checking the map earlier so yeah, plenty more to explore Okay, so they are here in Bangkok. I want the place to run. This is definitely the place. Quiet, peaceful, ah, fresh air, not much traffic. So yeah, I'm heading back to the jetty, okay, and by the uh, Srinakorn Park. So yeah, leaving you on this video and hope you like it and see you on the next one stay safe and keep well